strawberry season is in full force. And as NBC4i.com reporter Tony Morones tells us, local farmers were worried it might never come because of a lack of help, but also a cool and wet April. After the dark days of winter, farmers waded through the cold, wet rains of spring and didn't know if the u pick season would come. It stayed cold and wet, and that's just pushed us back. Typically, strawberry picking would have started after Mother's Day. Gretchen Hahn's two acres of strawberries are ripe for the picking now. We get a lot of families, especially a lot of young families with kids and stuff. They, they enjoy coming out here, having that experience, letting their kids, you know, pick their own produce. And if you're not sure how to pick strawberries properly, here's a quick tip. You know, you're going to kind of want to get down in here, move the plant around to where you find the berry. And especially with these early ones, see how that's still kind of white on one side? Yeah. That's not fully ripe. We want it to be that nice red color on both sides. This is still going to be kind of bitter. But let's pretend this was completely ripe. What you want to do is just get a hold of it and snap it off there. Try to keep that cap on there because that'll preserve it just slightly longer. Once the picking season begins, it'll last anywhere from two to four weeks and depends on how many people show up. Local for you near Obetz, Tony Moronis, NBC4i.com. And we called Han Farms uh, Market today. We learned that they have been so busy, they may have to close for a couple of days to let more strawberries ripen. Oh. So be sure to call the farm that you want to visit just to make sure that they're open. You can find a list of the you pick strawberry patches at NBC4i.com. Yeah, and hopefully with the weather we're looking toward this weekend, we're going to see a little, Maybe that time. little more activity. Maybe those berries will be a little there more. There you right. go. Yeah. I like it. Did you know how to pick a strawberry before? Uh, no, I have never done that, so there I have go. been educated.